you. guys so I am now back from the American Girl store and I did get a couple of items so I will be showing them to you guys so let's just get into this quick little haul all right so first I'm going to be showing you guys the free giveaway so it is this little pouch thingy and then territory of Hawaii identification certificate and then speak Hawaiian all right now on to the stuff that I bought so the first item that I bought I've wanted this ever since it leaked a while ago and it is Logan's singular outfit. The one outfit that they gave him so that you would realize that he isn't an accessory. So this is his performance outfit and I absolutely love this leather jacket. I really was considering not buying this because I think it's like $34. Yeah, that's how much it is, I think. But I just love this leather jacket. Alright, I do apologize for that short little bump. My camera just died and I had to recharge the battery, which took like half an hour, but I'm back now. So it has this leather jacket and it says like AG right here and I think that is literally the most adorable thing ever, oh my god. And then there's like a gray shirt under it and some skinny jeans and these two little sh booties short booties things. So this is actually in the new AG packaging, which I've not attempted to open yet. So let's get into that. I don't really know how you do it. I think it's the same as like our generation. I really don't know. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I really don't get it. I don't get how you take this out. See, this is why the old packaging is so much better. I really dislike this new packaging. I don't think it's cute. I will do a more in-depth review. Oh, all of this stuff. Oh my god, that boot just, oh my god, it wanted out of this packaging. <laughs> when I have it on my dolls, I'm so glad I bought this outfit because I just was, I was really considering not buying it and it's just so cute and I'm so excited to be using it. So here's the adorable little leather jacket. Then we have these adorable little jeans and actually they aren't really skinny jeans, but they are jeans and they have this adorable little um, detail on it. So here's the other item I bought and this is actually from Nenea's collection. Originally I wanted the outfit that what they just released for Melody. I think it's called like her birthday outfit or something. Anyways, it's that super cute purple outfit and it is sold out everywhere. It sold out on like the day it came out because it's just, it's incredibly adorable. So it was sold out at the DC store, which is the one I went to. So when it does come back into stock, then I will be buying that. But I just walked past the display and Nenea was wearing this in her display and I I knew that I had to have it so this was kind of an impulse buy but it is such an adorable outfit and I really did want something from Nenea's collection this dress is so cute so it's like this floral print and okay I, I keep okay I'm okay okay I'm such a mess. I'm gonna try to refrain from actually reviewing this stuff as I am uh, unboxing it because I do wanna do a more in-depth review on it, you know, when I'm putting it on the dolls. And here are the adorable little shoes, which feel really nice. These are really heavy, really nice quality. I love it. And then we have this little Nenea name tag, which I won't be using because I don't have Nenea. And then we have this Remember Pearl Harbor little pin. All right, and then we have this, which is just for eating. Get it, because it says do not eat. Anyways, so I'm going to put all this stuff on my dolls and then I will come back to you guys and show y'all how it looks. I'm really excited. It's like really cute. Oh my God. All right, so I have Jess and Regal dressed in the outfits and I'm gonna do some in-depth reviews for you guys so you guys can just like see kind of the details of the outfits, you know, get a feel of the quality, stuff like that. So let's get into it. So the outfit that Jess is wearing is Nenea's school outfit and the outfit is four pieces. So it is this dress, these 
shoes. And then it also came with these pins that I am not planning to use. So it came with this pin that says Nenea on it. There's this other pin that says Remember Pearl Harbor. Onto this dress. So it has this top that has pleats as it goes into this waistband. And on camera these flowers look really orange, but they're actually kind of like a pink color. They're like a salmon pink. And it's really cute. So the sleeves are also pleated, so they're kind of puffy, which I think is adorable. And then as you can see, it just velcros here in the back. Then for the skirt. So the skirt is ruffled and it comes out of the waistband. And then there's another piece coming out of that piece which is also ruffled. And I just, I really like the look of this dress. I think it is super adorable. I think it looks great on Jess. However, I wish that you guys could see how these flowers are actually kind of like pink. I absolutely love these shoes. So the fabric is kind of like a thin canvasy kind of fabric and it has this adorable navy blue and white pattern. It's really cute. I don't really know how to describe it so y'all can just see it on the camera. And then the soles of the shoes are just these navy blue plastic and how I put them on is I looped them around her ankle these shoes are actually like really adorable overall I give this outfit like a 9 out of 10 I would have given it a 10 out of 10 if the fabric on the dress didn't feel kind of cheap it does feel kind of cheap but not that bad so of course I'm going to start out with my favorite item in this set and probably everyone's favorite item that's probably why like everyone bought this so this is the leather jacket it's leather it's actually um fake leather called pleather now my problem with this is that this is like really cheap pleather and when you look at this it's not lined whatsoever so it's just like this cheap fabric, it's really thin, and on the inside, it's not lined whatsoever. So that really kind of bothers me because this outfit is actually pretty expensive, but the buttons are real buttons. Look at this, whoa! One of my absolute favorite things about this jacket is this little patch right here, and it says AG. And then there's also this patch on the sleeve right here, and it's a green circle with a star inside. I don't know what this means. Um, I'm sure if I read Tenny's book, I would know what it means. I almost said Logan's book, but then I remembered he doesn't have a book because he's just an accessory. So now let's take this off and I will review the shirt. So here's the shirt and it is just a gray and blue baseball tee. And I actually really like this because I think it can be used with like a lot of different pieces. And I really like it when outfits have pieces that aren't like super specific to the outfits and you can kind of use them for multiple things because I feel like then you're kind of getting more for your money. So, all right. Here's my problem with this shirt. Here in the back, the Velcro does not come all the way down. As you can see, it only comes about halfway down. And this is really annoying to me because this is typically something that cheaper brands do, like Our Generation and Springfield, stuff like that, because it's less money to use less Velcro. I would be okay if I bought this shirt from Our Generation or Springfield or somewhere like that, but I did, I paid a lot of money for this outfit. So I would have liked if the Velcro had come down all the way. So the jeans are just regular dark jeans and I originally thought they were gonna be skinny jeans But they're kind of like regular skinny. They're not they're like halfway in between regular and skinny, you know? Yeah, you know, um, there's not a lot to say about them. The pockets are Semi working. They're not like completely fake, but like if you wanted your dolls like Finger to be in it that would work. So here are the shoes and I've put them under the jeans. So let me roll up the jeans on one leg. So they are these brown shoes and they have black soles and they're boots but they don't come up that high. They come up to like a little above the ankle and then they have these elastic here so you can get them on and off the doll so there's like no velcro in the back. Overall I give this outfit an 8 out of 10 because even though it's so incredibly cute I feel like the cheapness of the jacket like really bothers me. Of course I'm still gonna use it because it's like the cutest little piece of doll clothing I've ever Ever owned. Anyways guys, that is it for my video today. If you want to see more like review type videos like this, then do let me know down in the comment section because I don't really do a lot of review videos. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you all later. Bye!